How to fix Fortnite? Sorry you're visiting our service too frequently. Please try again later. If you're facing this problem while logging into Epic, here's the video where I will show you some simple steps in order to fix this problem. First and foremost, what you have to do is in the search bar, you have to simply type in run and you have to type this command, which is percentage app data percentage. Click OK. Once app data loads, you have to click on local, find Epic Games Launcher, double click and open it, go to save, web cache. You're gonna find this folder, open it up, select everything from here and simply permanently delete this. What is this? These are all cache files which are not required by the Epic Games Launcher. So simply just select everything and simply just delete them. Once they are deleted, you open your Epic Games Launcher, try to sign in, see if that helps. Next step, what you can do is, if you're having any issues with your network or it able to sign in somewhere, simply change your network. What does it mean? If you're using a LAN connection, try using a mobile hotspot, then try to log in into your Epic Games Launcher, see if that helps. Third step, what you can do is, try logging in Epic Games Launcher in a different device. For example, if you're having two PCs in your home, try to log in your same account in a different computer on the same network which you're having, or you can even log in in your phone. If it's working on the phone, then come back to the same computer where you're having issues in signing in, open the Epic Games Launcher, simply sign in, see if that helps. Next step, what you can do is, you can change your DNS server. For this, what you have to do is, first and foremost, you have to go to the corner of your screen and on the network, you have to right click and click on open network and internet settings. Over here, you have to click on change adapter options and this window will come up. From here, you have to choose whichever network you're using. I'm currently using Wi-Fi, so I'm going to choose it, right click, go to properties, and over here, this small window, here you have to choose Internet Protocol version 4, TCP slash IP version 4. Go to Properties, and here set that Obtain DNS Server Address automatically. You have to tick the bottom one, which is use the following DNS Server Address. And I will recommend you using the Google DNS Server, which is 8888-8844. This is Google's public DNS Server. If you want a better one, which is even more stable than that, you can use that also, which is the Cloudflare DNS server, which is 11111001. So you just need to press OK and then restart your computer and see if that fixes your problem. So those were the steps in order to fix this problem. If you're still having the issue, don't forget to put down in the comment section. I'll try to help you out as fast as possible. If this video helped you, please don't forget to like button, consider subscribing to my channel if you're new here. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. -bye.